Hey everybody, today I'm going to show you a really cool antivirus that I found on the internet and that some business wanted me to review on. It's called Immunit Protect and it's by far one of the awesomest ant free antiviruses I've ever seen in my life. The cool part about it, one of the cool features is if you have an already an antivirus like I do, I have AVG antivirus free. Um you don't need to delete that like most antiviruses you need to delete your old antivirus so you can install a new one for this one you don't need to delete crap immunit works together with your other antivirus to protect your computer most likely it's not opening there you go so this is the software in general so the thing right here says programs installed in the last two weeks, the clean files, and the threats. On February 12th, was, which was yesterday, two clean programs were installed. 60 clean programs were installed today. Oh. I don't know what 60 clean programs were installed today, but whatever. And one threat detected. That's really cool because it actually helps and tells you and it works together with your antivirus. Now, as you can tell right here, it says AVG antivirus is also running. And bottom here, it says create an account and invite your friends and family to join your protection network via MySpace or Facebook. You know, you can register this computer for an online account. Uh, it's about it. I'm running the 1.0.25 of immunit protection so let's look in history uh, so it shows all the crap I've downloaded or installed uh, all this crap I installed and what happened with my computer security wise um, well these were all Windows updates I updated my iTunes and uh, a lot of other stuff. I updated my ABG. No, I guess this was something I accidentally downloaded. But it's deleted now. Which is really good. Uh, I found, an found another one. But it was, and it was quarantined. Now the cool part about immune protection is uh, you can also restore them even though your antivirus took it out you can restore it with immune protect because sometimes antiviruses get mistaken mistaken programs for viruses and which can really be a bitch but yeah if you know it's not trust your instincts so let's go to scan the file scan nothing nothing scan in progress uh, yeah, all these scan options, scan running processes. I turn all these on just in case. Let's go to settings. So, protection settings, monitor application install, monitor application start, active protection mode, ethos protection. The verbals train notifications. I'm not really sure what that is, so I didn't really want it on. And right here it says exclusion. Now what you could do is get a program or file or folder that you do not want to be scanned and add it right here. So click on the drop arrow, it says file or folder, file extension, threat name. And you and it won't be deleted or scanned. So to download this awesome antivirus slash extension, go to eminit.com and it's self updated which is really cool and all these recent virus protected or detections now you can also sign in or connect with them through Facebook which is really cool you can follow them on Twitter also so all you can do is just click get protected click on the orange button so now it says step one download immediate protection Select your version of Windows, 32-bit or 64-bit. Click on it. Click on download. And the system requirements are just simple. Microsoft. 
Windows XP Server Spec 2, Vista Server Spec 1, Vista, Windows 7, R the RTM. So yeah, this is just little stuff. You can uh, also create an email account if you want. It's an option. So yeah, I recommend all you guys getting this because a little extra security would never kill anybody. But just in case something ever happens, you got Immunit and your other antivirus. And if you don't have another antivirus, I recommend you getting Immunit Protect. So yeah, that was my review for Immunit Protect antivirus. I hope you guys download this antivirus. It is really good. It's really sufficient and everything. So that's all for today. Thanks for watching. Rate, comment, and subscribe. Gonna go play some Modern Warfare 2.